Okay friends, yes, we are back with a new photo shoot and you can see we will photo shoot today with Kati. Yes, we have today the Sony A6000 and the Sony A6700. Yes, it's really good weather today. We also found uh, the first photo shoot location here with the cherry blossom tree. Yes, we will photo shoot today with a lot of cherry blossom trees, which will be very good. And Kati has amazing dresses today. So yeah, we will now start, show you examples and compare both cameras. Spending my time believing that I'm flying like a cannonball. Yeah. What if I'm just concealing that I'm waiting for a star to fall? Won't you do me a favor? Won't you hit me a baby? All this time I'm looking at my telephone. I'm thinking of your hands and the way you make them dance on me, on me. Dynamite, you just blew my mind right now, right now, right, right now. One more night, baby, come and show me how, me how, show me how. Okay friends, yeah, next location you can see we're here at the Cherry Blossom Street. It's so beautiful guys, it's one of the best locations here in Bielefeld. It's really worth to go here. So guys, Bielefeld City, yes, we will now post it here with the way. And yes, we will yeah, show you examples again and let's just hope it's not so busy, but so far it's going pretty good. So yeah, we will now start here. When I got close, my heart was pumping To the beat that was blasting through the night And on the street, the crowd was jumping Singing songs and dancing through the night I didn't think that I would ever see your face again But I was wrong I can't believe guys next location we are here now at the car park it's a bit more quiet here which is much much better because it was so full at the cherry blossom street so yeah we started doing some photos here and you can see uh, we already did some Kati can also show some so yeah they're amazing so we will now compare the difference in low light we already did some and I noticed that the Sony A6700 was a bit better, but image-wise, both are very, very similar. So at the end of this video, I will also let you know my opinion on both and which one is more worth getting. So we will now continue and show you more. Girl, every time I close my eyes, I see your smile in the morning light. And girl, every time I
Hey friends, we made it. We are now at the end of the photo shoot. You can see the sun is back again. And yeah, we decide now to finish the photo shoot. You can see we have again here both cameras, both APC cameras. And yeah, guys, I just wanted to let you know what my opinion is on both. So I, I didn't really notice a difference really that much. Both cameras are really good. The Sony a6000 can definitely compete with the Sony a6700. Of course, the Sony a6000 is 10 years old, but it's still a great camera in 2021. The image quality is insane, especially when you pair it with a great lens. For example, what we did with the Sigma 30mm. So at the end, guys, it's really the lens which counts. So if you're a beginner, I would recommend you to buy a very, very good lens like a Sigma 30 30 millimeter or six Sigma 56 millimeter. And then for example, use the Sony a6000 or Sony a6400. The Sony a6700 is of course also good, um, but it's really, really expensive. So it's, you really have to think uh, twice if you want to buy it because there are other options as well for the same price range. So uh, yeah, I will definitely review the Sony a6700 also with the Sony a7 III. You can check out the video up here. So it's already online, guys. You can check it out. And guys, everyone is now coming, the planes, so we, the cars. So we will wrap up the photo shoot now. And guys, thanks for watching. Take care and see you next time. Bye. Paradise, and now every time I fall.